Hi, I'm Tristan Mann. And I'm Tristan Mann. Halloween's next week. On Monday, which is Halloween, we have a half day. And then Tuesday, we have no school. The scariest thing for seniors this year isn't any monster. But it's not se turning in your senior portraits to Mr. Trombley. That means get it in or he'll find you. This week's yet another theme week. Monday was pajama day. Today's a celebrity day. Tomorrow will be Halloween colors. Thursday will be Miss Odo day, which we have Michigan colors for. And Friday will be dress up as a staff member day. Throughout this week, there will be kindergrams sold by student council for $1. There's not much to report on this week, but here's your weekly sports update. I'm Tristan Mann, bringing you your weekly sports update. Last Thursday, our volleyball teams both played against Ida. JV lost, but Varsity won a tough game going into five sets. Last Friday, our Varsity football team took on our former AP Miss Ferguses Riverview Pirates. Our team lost 49-27. Because of this loss, Mr. Pulitzi had to wear a Riverview shirt yesterday. Last week, Minerva swam against Dexter, losing 40 to 144. Their standout athletes were freshman Abby Dykeman, Captain Lauren Lana, seniors Natalie and Olivia Sinowick, Alice House, Delaney Willie, Wiley, Willie? I don't know how to say that name. Their coach says she's happy to see where they are at time-wise now. The kids have been training very hard and have prepared themselves for a great end of season push. In cross country, Saturday, October 16th was the Dave Bork Classic at Munson Park. Thursday, both the boys and girls competed in the conference meet. Luke Butler, Victoria Blaniars, and Kyle Hoffner all received all conference honors. Saturday, the team competed in the Airport Mark of Excellence Invitational. The girls team placed first and the boys placed second. That's all I have for you for your weekly sports update. Be sure to tune in next time for more updates and highlights from Peyton Renwick. Well, that sure was some interesting sports news. But with that, we're wrapping up for this week. I'm Tristan Mann, and I'm Tristan Mann. That's all we have for you this week. Remember to make it happen, Monroe. Have a happy Halloween. We'll see you next time.